your weekly astrology and this week we have Venus, the planet of love, earthing our passion and our romance and some lovely, doing some lovely Venusian things. But we also have Saturn, the lord of seriousness, clashing with the sun. So there may be a few ego issues. Here's your weekly astrology. <laughs> Taurus, this week starting on the 11th is a week where Venus is giving you a few of her delicious gifts. Hooray! At last you can relax and chill out a bit. Having said that, just before that we do have Saturn, the sensible and the sun clashing and having a little bit of argy-bargy together. This may be somewhat disturbing for you because you're just getting to the point where you're feeling good about yourself. Suddenly someone's kicking off. Now, this is all about a sense of power and powerlessness. But you know the score. Sometimes we've got these triggers. And someone pokes that trigger and we're like, oh, you know, and we can flare up or, or react or feel a wounded ego. Walk away from anything that's damaging your ego and reflect on things that are to do with obsession and, and intensity and money and power. Maybe somebody's pointing out something to you that you need to listen to. Either way, move your ego to one side because there are better planetary fish to fry. And these fish are big because they're involving Venus, your ruler. Yeah. Venus is, first of all, shrine Saturn. So she's making friends. She's like, yes, Saturn. Hi, baby. And Saturn is going to help you out when it comes to your relationships. Venus is in your position of home and family. So you are feeling... Like you want to snuggle up, you want to be close to the people that you love, you want to be around people that, that kind of make you feel safe. And Saturn is in your position of power and powerlessness. But on this occasion, you feel powerful. There could even be a new financial commitment with a lover and everything feels right, everything feels stable, everything feels good to you. Now, even, even better than that, well, just as good as that on the 15th, we have Venus sextile, Jupiter the planet of good fortune and it seems to be that you have the opportunity to expand and grow and get some real healthy habits and he healthy routines in your personal relationships and individually you're feeling much better about yourself you're feeling much more secure you may decide to redecorate or to transform your environment in some way but either way there should be an optimistic air to this week do you love yourself how are you feeling about home and family? Great healing could be, have, could be had here and now. Take care, gorgeous, and I'll speak to you soon. Hello, wonderful one. Thank you so much for listening. It would be fabulous if you liked, subscribed, or shared. It would be really, really helpful. Also, I have a ton of free stuff for you horoscope.co.uk for everything astrology and michellenight.com for everything psychic and free tarot reading. See you there.